Hello. Welcome. Welcome back to me yet again hating what my bookshelves look like and needing to rearrange them. Again, I don't know how many times I've done this this year. I think we're on to the third time, which is not normal, but also I have a problem with buying books. Uh, exhibit A. Whoops. That happened. And we're gonna fix it. So I'm actually being kind of uh, efficient because I'm about to film a video where I talk about every single book series that I'm in the middle of or have started or like want to continue whatever. And to do that I was going to take books off my bookshelf, but I'm like if I'm already taking a bunch of books off of my bookshelf, I might as well also film me doing that for this video because I'm going to be organizing these because I have a problem with book buying and I've gotten rid of like 30 books as of recent. Granted they are still on my bookshelf, but we're going to fix that problem. And we're gonna put them in my car the next time I go to half price I will actually get rid of them like I had planned to originally but we need to get started because I do not have a infinite amount of time today and I need to take some books off my shelf so let's let's do that let's start let's let's get this intro over with and just kind of move on we're gonna scooch you in a little closer uh, top shelves that I cannot reach I will have my roommate come in shortly and take those down but in the meantime, I think I can handle myself. Maybe, honestly. <laughs> Not sure at this point. Okay, phase one is complete, and now I um, will film a different video and then come back to this one. It'll be great. Okay, this is the state of my shelves now. Honestly, I didn't take that many books off for them to still be looking this ratchet, but here we are. Those are the books that I have taken off. Okay, so I'm not doing like a full organization I decided because some shelves I do actually like, but like my Rangers Apprentice shelves are probably gonna change. I might have to shuffle some things around. We'll see. <laughs> I just, like I'm in the mood because like I need to give you self short These shelves sorted. But I'm like, no longer really in the mood to do it. <laughs> Actually like take the time to do it. But I wanna put, I wanna like flip kinda how my bookshelves are. Cause I have like like a pretty rainbow situation on the top of my shelf and then all my, like, my extra books at the bottom. But I kinda wanna put those towards the top because the bottom of my shelves are actually in a lot of my shots. And I'm getting annoyed with the bottom of my shelves looking ugly as fuck. So we gotta fix that. <laughs> Which starts with like taking the books off the top shelf. Hey, Addy. Hey, bestie, can you offer some assistance? I'm using my tongs. I am using my tongs. I just like... <laughs> I can't reach the top shelf. I can like get the ones that I like slid for. Well, okay, I said I... I said I could. I swear I can. Hello, daddy. <laughs> Hi. Okay, it me. I just need all the books off the top shelf, basically. Oh, okay. Yeah. We, 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 we're doing shit. I can help, I can help. Slave labor. Oh. <laughs> Chew tomato. This. Mm -hmm. Tomato. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of balancing like surprisingly well. <laughs> like I'm kind of. And I just like I didn't even try to balance it. I just Dance. went. Boop. <laughs> ah! Like really entertained. I want two more of these so I can learn how to juggle. Hey Katie, make me two more of these so I can learn how to juggle, please. I can teach and then you how to juggle. I know. I know. <laughs> I think that's that's the cue to continue. <laughs> Thank you. 
again. <laughs> okay, we'll do we'll do like a shelf by shelf. I'll explain my very chaotic thoughts, which are actually just no thoughts. I was just throwing books on my shelf by the end, but it's done. Okay, so the top shelf, I literally like, hello, I cannot reach. So I put my I don't know. I don't know what I did. <laughs> so we have a white shelf up here, and I just moved that up because I rarely grab books off of there. And then I did a little bit of color coding here, but then I couldn't fit more than like a lot of red books on there. So it's only slightly color coded. And then we have all my black books over here. Not all of them, but just again, same situation where I just kind of like moved them up a shelf. Then we have Harry Potter, Aragon, and the Red Queen series because they're nice and even, and they kind of look cohesive as a unit, which is nice. Then we have the Name of the Wind Shrine. I don't feel like I really need to preface why I have this shelf, but I love it. A lot. Anyway, moving on. We have this kind of like red, green, blue shelf, which accidentally came to exist because of like, I wanted the Avatar books forward facing. And then I was like, there are a lot of series with red, green, and blue. And then we have a crunchy little tomato. Moving right along, these shelves all stay the same. Love them. They are, yes, love them. <sighs> I don't love this shelf, but I needed a place to put a lot of fantasy books, so I just kind of like shoved them on this shelf. And this is what it is now. This shelf did not change at all. This shelf did though, because I was like, I spent a lot of money on these books. I want to properly display them. And I, I freaking love them. I will say this is a little uneven. That's a little better. There we go. Nice and pretty. Same with this situation. Didn't really change other than I didn't forward face things anymore. And then we get down to the bottom where there's a lot of new shelves. Here we have a little Sergei Maas Throne of Glass. Needed to put those series somewhere. I don't know if I want to get rid of my paperbacks and buy hardbacks because they look so much nicer. But for now, we're chilling with the paperbacks. This book, I feel like, needs to swish back a little. Am I obsessed enough with the From Blood and Ash series to have a whole shrine like this? No, but do I like how it looks? Yes, and we're gonna roll with it. This, however, properly deserves the shrine that it has. I really like how I displayed these for I can see all the covers because I literally am in love with these. And then this cute little mug that Katie gave me as well. Well, I say cute. It's like a very intense scene from the book, but I love it. My romance shelf slash random manga not super proud of, but it looks better than it was before. That shelf is just like <laughs> full of children's books, so we're ignoring that. And five copies of Ranger's Apprentice. Why do I have five copies of Ranger's Apprentice? Moving right along. Kind of a miscellaneous dump shelf as well, um, with two collector's edition forward facing, but I kind of like how it looks in a weird way. I don't know. I'm vibing with it. Then we have this kind of pretty-ish shelf. Again, didn't know what I was going for. I wanted six Crimson Cranes forward facing and a Heart of the Sun Warrior forward facing because they are freaking gorgeous. This is like a sci-fi-esque shelf. In fact, actually like, yeah, it's mostly sci-fi, a little bit of fantasy on there, but it was like the color palette kind of worked. I really like what I did with the Lunar Chronicles alternating between the covers. I think that just is immaculate. I love it so much. I wish it took up the whole shelf. And then this random ass shelf, which actually does not look terrible. But it doesn't look good, you know? That's the vibe we're going for. Also, sneakily in this corner here, I have all the books I'm getting rid of. I actually added quite a few to the pile because I was like organizing my shelf and I was like, I don't feel like organizing around these books, nor do I plan on rereading them. So if any of y'all want some of these, let me know. Get them out of my house. <laughs> my mother says I look acceptable now, correct? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end of the video. I really hope you enjoyed this kind of like easy, relaxing kind of organization. I, hopefully I edit it to where it's relaxing because I was just stressed the whole time. I got near the end and I was looking around at my floor and I was like, I have too many books. So do I have a box of books in my closet? Yes. But that is besides the point. Thank you so much to my lovely patrons over on KSX Cast. Your support of the channel literally means the world. We have some little bonus content. They were able to see what my bookshelves looked like before this video was even posted, as well as the absolute chaos of what my floor was looking like for a little bit there. So it's a fun, fun time over there. And I want to thank all of you for watching all the way to the very end. And I really, really hope to see you in the next one. Toodles!